hello guys welcome back to my channel yet is another thursday so i'm going to be showing you how to tie a wedding guest gilly like the ashoke gilly this is the 70 30 part gilly so we are going to be tying that like um placing it on the head which the 730 the 70 30 means the other side is going to be longer than the other one can you see i just placed it on a head pleats like five pleats and then pass one to the other side but the shorter hand is going to be on top of the longer one behind her head so you don't put the longer one under the longer one sorry the longer one behind her head is going to be under the shorter one the shorter one will be on top of the longer hand behind her head so i just continued pleating from where i stopped as after i rolled the longer one on top of the shorter hand So if you see i just kept pleating 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 and in order for it not to be pleated from the beginning to the end i just started um losing my hand and making it big big bigger at the end of the gilly so if you noticed i'll just leave my hand fold it and it's going to look like a fan like the hand fan gilly this is called the fan gilly self so um normally i always tie this on a wedding dress so that she should look elegant and all that so can you see this i just folded it and then started losing my hand at the end i'll ask my model to press it down for me until i finish the pleating then i'll rearrange it i was in a hurry but you can take your time to just finish this gilly and simple so as i was tying it at the back i just held the two hands together and tie it and then boom yeah this is it i am showing you now so can you see i just held the two handles together and then tied them both at the back but i'll be asking you make sure you ask your model to hold it very tightly like the pleat so that it doesn't lose yeah so this is it then i'm going to fold the middle i'll ask her to turn back so the remaining thing i'll be doing at the back is just to tuck everything in and retie it again for the second time so that the knot will be tight and um it won't lose easily even if she dances at the wedding so i'm just going to arrange the pleats and then make sure everything is perfect so yeah yeah guys so if you have not subscribed to my youtube channel please do that now turn on your notification bell don't forget to like subscribe and also share um yeah this is hadidi makeovers once again i'm going to be seeing you guys on tuesday um yeah Head. and that's it guys i'll see you guys on tuesday this is hadidi makeovers once again bye